Hello. In the last video that I put on LinkedIn, I was stood in a field and I was talking to you about New Year's resolutions because I was filming just at the end of 2016, just as we were about to go into the new year of 2017. It was New Year's resolution time. And at the end of the old year, at the start of a new year, it's the one time of the year above any other time of year when we start thinking about ourselves and how we can make positive improvements in our situations, in our wealth, our happiness, our well-being, you know, a general situation. And I was suggesting back in that other video that the thing to go for in 2017, the thing that you and I should go for is simply our happiness. Go for happiness in 2017. Why was that? Well, simply, if you're not happy in anything that you do in your home or in your personal life, then why bother and what's the point? Happiness is everything. It's the biggest prize that life has got to offer us. So let's go and grab it. Let's improve it in 2017. And the great news is that wherever you are in your personal happiness, whether you are really, really happy, happy, okay, or just dang miserable, it's absolutely possible. The gift is in your hands to improve your happiness wherever you're starting from right now and take it to a higher and higher level. Back in the other video, I shared two keys with you that will help you to improve your personal happiness. The first key was to put gratitude in your attitude, to live every single day as if it was this last day on earth. If you were told tomorrow that it was going to be your last day, I would suggest to you that you would be filled with gratitude for anything that came your way. From the type of food you were eating, to the people that you met, to problems that came along, to the weather, anything in that day you would have pure gratitude for. You'd just love on it and you know, you'd know you live it to the full. So let's do that. Let's put gratitude in our attitude. That's the first key. The second key that I shared with you, with you was to start giving. Give to yourself. Above everything, give to yourself. Give yourself some time. Some time to think about you and what you want, what you want to happen for you, what happiness means to you. Research it. Spend time on you. Give to you and give to everything, to everyone, strangers in the street, to the people that you love the most. Give, just give, give, give and life will start giving back to you because life gives to the giver and takes from the taker. The more you give to life, if you give something to life, life will return it to you tenfold. So start giving. And if you are in a position where you want to improve your happiness, if you want to go and make a dream come true, then I put it to you, and it's an old saying, that something's got to give. And that something that's got to give is you. So key number one is gratitude in your attitude. Key number two is to start giving. I'm now offering you a gift as a gift. Key number three, which can help you to improve your happiness. And that third key simply is to go and to make your dreams come true. Now, when I start talking about dreams, please do not get hung up on the word dreams. Do not get put off by the word dreams because some people do. Substitute dreams with the word target or goal. But you need to make your dreams come true if you're going to be happy. And I'm offering up to you now as a gift the steps that you need to take to make your dreams come true. Now, I devised these steps, these rules in 2010. I tried and I tested them. I road tested them. And I, all the dreams that I set for myself back then all came true. I went from a night shift cabbie driving in Southampton, driving 70,000 miles a year, going nowhere because I always ended up right back where I started. I ended up going from a night shift cabbie to lose eight stone in weight to run marathons in New York and London and raise thousands of pounds for charity. I became an author, a motivational speaker in schools, businesses and colleges, and I'm now the head of UK business. I simply changed my life, all down to the rules of dreaming that I devised. And those rules were new to me. I made them up. I invented them. I put them into play and they worked. All my dreams come true. But as I researched further into dreaming and into what you need to make your dreams come true, I discovered that the rules that I had invented, actually, although they were new to me, had been around forever. And only relatively a few people follow those rules. Be one of those people that follow those rules. Nothing new in what I'm about to say to you, what I'm going to share with you, is new. There's nothing new in it. You already know what I'm about to tell you because you were born with all that you need to succeed in your life. 
all that you need to be happy and all that you need to make your dreams come true. You were born with positivity, with a can-do attitude and with imagination. But many of us, as we get older, as we live our lives, we fall foul to negativity that exists in life, to the negative conditioning of life. We get caught up in the headlights of our life and we forget to dream. And as a result, we settle for less and we end up unhappy, frustrated and filled with regret. And as we get older, we become bitter and we become resentful. Do not let that happen to you. If you want to make changes in your life to be happier, follow the steps that I gladly are going to share with you. I'm not asking you to believe what I'm telling you. All I'm asking is that you simply give what I'm saying a go. Give it a go. Because if you want to improve your happiness and get to a better place in your life, I simply say to you, well, what have you got to lose by giving it a go? The key thing for you to know is that your thoughts are everything. What you think will happen, will happen. What you think about, you attract. And that is the law of attraction. It is just so critical that you think positive thoughts. Now, here's a warning. Be careful about what you dream about, because your dreams may become true. That's a time-old saying. Now, who said that? Why did they say it? What had happened to them? The law of attraction is both a blessing and a curse. If you think positive, you'll attract positive. If you think negative, you'll attract negative. So wake up to your thoughts. Be very aware of your thoughts. Be wide awake, wide-eyed awake when dreaming. Ensure you are focusing only on the very positive. So here, here for you now is key number three in your pursuit of increased happiness. The rules for making your dreams come true. Here they are. Rule number one, dare to dream. You've got to want it badly enough. Dare to dream. Rule number two, go beyond your fear. Rule number three, tell people about your dreams. As many people as you can, but not negative people, not the dream busters in life, because those people will talk you out of going for your dream. The people you do tell will help you, will give you motivation and will keep you going for it. Rule number four, just do it. Take the first steps. Number five, have blind faith and belief that your dream is going to come true. And rule number six is stick to your plan. So here's the rules again. Rule one, dare to dream. Two, go beyond your fear. Three, tell people about your dream. Four, just do it. Five, have blind faith and belief. And six, stick to your plan. It's all very simple, isn't it? There's nothing spectacular here. But these rules, they work. You just have to have a massive expectation that your dreams will happen. Now, life will test you and test you and test you. But if you don't give up, if you do not give in, life will decide to help you. If it can happen for me, it surely can happen for you. In summary, I'd just like to say, make 2017 your year. Go for happiness. Go for your happiness. Put gratitude in your attitude. Start giving. Start dreaming. And make it happen. And remember, all that you are and all that you will ever be is a direct result of your thoughts and your dreams and the actions that you take around the decisions that you make. Thank you and good luck.